Joe Biden issued a decree that you can take off your mask, Logan. Yeah, I saw that. He, he gave this like really hostile ultimatum where he was like, the choice is yours. You can either get vaccinated or you can wear a mask until you do. And my comeback to that was, the choice is yours. You can either de- uh, retire with dignity or you can experience cognitive decline humiliatingly in public. So <laughs> That's very true. Yeah. I saw a Joseph Stalin Twitter parody account that's just been retweeting like Joe Biden's account. <laughs> that one was perfect. <laughs> that's, that's great. I think people are taking the CDC recommendations seriously, though, because I walked over here today and like nobody's wearing a mask outside anymore. Two days ago, everybody was wearing a mask outside. Now today, nobody's doing it. I guess the CDC gave them permission. So now that they're they feel like it's OK. I mean, it makes me sad that people feel like they need the CDC's permission yeah. to do it. But I'm glad at least that they're starting to wake up and see reason. Now it becomes a very now the next craziness i think is going to be the ver- verification process which did you send out the meme with the, did someone say it like papers someone sent a paper please no i saw someone else it wasn't it me. me it was obviously a meme about like papers please for your verification but that's gonna be mm. next because yeah. let's just say a company says like all right guys if you've been vaccinated you can don't have to wear a mask at the office anymore like well how are you gonna know who's who yeah they're gonna try to find out so now you're gonna have to uh. share that information with your employer i don't know if that's a hipaa violation or not i'm not a lawyer because you Obviously, if you send your kid to a public school, you have to prove that kid's yeah. been vaccinated. So maybe not. I don't know. I have to ask someone who's... Yeah, I don't think it'll matter. But it's going to create a whole nother level of bureaucracy now. We have to see how, like, these venues, like concert venues and movie theaters and stuff, how willing are they to try to actually enforce this? Because it's going to be a huge pain to enforce. Are it's, they just going to say, like, okay, if you're vaccinated, you don't have to wear a mask. If you aren't vaccinated, please do it, and then just not enforce it? Or are they going to actually try to enforce it? If they do try to enforce it, I think it's going to be a nightmare for everybody. There's going to be technology. Some, some entrepreneurs can come up with technology now where I don't know how it's going to work, but they're going to try to track where you, you know, boop, boop, scan boop, your phone. That's and a it, good good point. Yeah, right boop, boop. Yeah, boop, boop, yeah. Point, yeah, boop, boop technology. As you go in, it says if you're vaccinated or not. And I think you just won the argument with boop, boop. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. I. And then there's the unendless questions now. Is this going to? You have to get vaccinated every year if you're for COVID. Is, yeah, I keep seeing things about how it wears off, and you're like, oh, it's only good for three months or six months, and it's like, well, that seems not great. So we're just gonna keep yeah. pumping our bodies full yeah. of whatever's in the vaccine. This is just, we're not thinking very far. No, it's not, it's short not, term. not long-term <laughs> thinking at all. Like just, I don't know. Like I was walking over here thinking about this today, and I wasn't sure how I felt about it because on the one hand, like it's good that they're giving you the option in a certain extent. So, like you can say okay, well, we're going to have unvaccinated sections and we're going to have vaccinated sections. Well, at least you can go in. Yeah. Like, I was worried they were just going to say you can't come in if you're not vaccinated. I don't like the sectioning. I don't like the apartheid either. I think that's really bad. But it's maybe a little bit better than just saying you are you can't participate in society it. until you do this stuff or making it mandatory. So I don't like either, but, you know, maybe we're moving in the right direction. I, maybe people, people will just get tired of this. Maybe people will just say, I don't want to do this anymore. Yeah, or maybe the cost. It, we'll see how costly it is to enforce this. If, it, yeah. if the cost goes too high, we don't do it. Yes. Mm-hmm.